situation today is very bad, and it will get worse. I vote every year, but this year I'm not voting. I don't expect anything. I never voted, and it's not important to vote because really no one, not in the past and not in the future, will do what is good for us, so I don't even think of voting. I'm not going to vote for anyone, not even for the Arabs, and I'll tell you why. They are not fighting for the Arabs who are Israeli Arabs. They fight for other things, for politics. In the last election, I voted for the joint Arab list, but they brought no change. Now we'll try and vote for someone else and hope for the best. Some strong criticism there from the Israeli Arab community. Your thoughts, how does it make you feel when you hear what people have to say? It's a strange that you choose four persons and no one is going to vote, which is far from reality. But there is a criticism, there is dissatisfaction. People are saying that they want influence. They want their issues to be brought to the government, to the coalition, to the parliament, in order to upgrade their status in economical issues, social, political, budgets, uh, anti-racist uh, legislations, uh, anti-crime and violence, uh, planning, demolition of houses, we are there in order to deal with, with these things. Only joint list is dealing with these issues of the Arab com community. When there is a criticism, we should take this into consideration, and we are doing so. We are telling people, you should go and vote in order to raise the turnout. Whenever we are stronger, the right will be weaker. If we will vote uh, with turnout more than in the past, we can do the change. We are willing to do the change. We are there in order, in order to influence, much more like our community is demanding from us. There are mechanisms, for example, blocking majority. I am waiting for, the, uh, uh, for that time to seize the opportunity, but I am not sure that Gantz will appeal to us. But we are willing to be there in order to change. Dr. Tibi, you talk about making change and that people are asking for change. We were hearing just a short while ago that your colleague Ayman Oder told the Khan Israeli channel that there is no ways that the joint list will join with Benny Gantz and a coalition government. Don't you feel you owe it to your supporters to get involved and be within a coalition government where you can really make a difference and make change? No, no, we can't be in uh, the next coalition of Kahol uh, Lavan of Gantz. Why not? Who is willing and saying that he will appeal and he will uh, 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 call first that he could to have unity government. His direction is far from our uh, 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 demands, but we will say our demands to Gantz if he will call us. He should listen to these demands of the Arab community. That's the way and the mechanism that we will create the change, will go toward the change. and the uh, statement that we will not join uh, 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 Gantz coalition, next Gantz coalition, is realistic. And that's the real position of the joint list, as we said in the last two weeks. Blocking majority, yes. Part of this government, no.